How often have you gone to a bakery and sat down in the most comfortable seats you've been in any eating establishment, right? Very nice. Ever, ever. Very comfy seats, which is very important. We are in perhaps one of the finest kosher bakery, also cafe type joints in the country, just based on their options alone and the quality of what they're serving. This is Hatif Bakery. Uh, what city are we in? Lindhurst, New Jersey. My name is Moses Wendell, and we are at Petit's Bakery in Lindhurst, New Jersey. And this location's been a bakery since the 1930s. We did gut renovate it. Uh, so, you know, in that sense, you know, especially from a, a kosher sense, you know, it ain't the same old bakery that it was before. Uh, but it's got like a, a spiritual background as a bakery. Our goal as a company is just to make people happy, you know. Uh, you know, the, my personal training and background is sort of that French European style and that's the, the sort of the style that I started with. Um, and I would say the majority of professional cooks, uh, of which we employ plenty uh, and, and have many sort of in our, our, our mix, uh, you know, are trained in. So obviously that's going to be the core of the operation. Margarita croissant. And what's that? That is a green croissant. Green. It's green. This a is a green. Gruyere in herb. You know these are dairy. These are for sure dairy, not just from the cheese, but from the texture of my finger and the way that the croissant is flaking and crusting. The croissant is a masterclass, right? And that's, that's what I'm saying. The flavor's on point and they delivered on the flavor. The fact that they delivered on the texture. Alrighty, that's a standard above anything else I think we're having on the current market. They have an egg sandwich on a croissant. Now we love, we love an egg and croissant. An egg croissant and cheese, they do something else with their egg. And I'm very excited because how do they cook their egg? I don't know actually, you gotta tell me. I want you to try it first. Mm. So that egg is the creamiest, creamiest egg you've ever had in the crispiest croissant you've ever yeah. had. It's one giant curd. How do they do that? It's steamed, steamed egg. I think I could say with 99% certainty, the only kosher establishment in the country serving a steamed egg cheese croissant. It's all about the texture. It's an egg and cheese on a great croissant. It all works 100%. This is the finest example. They also have this fantastic quiche. So quiche is like a good egg strata and a really nice kind of like pie crust. This does not taste like a kosher dairy product. What you have here is you have funky cheese, and you have mushrooms, and you have egg, and you have that truffle, and there's something secret in the crust. All of those together are very strong players. Wow. Okay, very strong players. And they're all gonna create something. And when you put all those together, I would dare say this is a shocking flavor to people who have only eaten kosher their yeah, whole life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a great way to understand something, yeah. but this is out of this you world. Have to sit with it for a second, because you're not sure what it is. No, I'm not sure at all. <laughs> This is called, I call him a canal. This canal is gonna blow your mind. Mm. A very like crackly crunchy, right? Almost honey-like. Um, but the inside is that strong kind of vanilla. But this is done beautifully because it's really a custard on the inside. It's a custard at heart. If you don't know what I'm talking about, do you ever have a cooler? Yeah. A cooler is a, is a custardy, like a soft set custardy. That's what a canal is. This is the bakery. Name me one other kosher joint that has a matcha, matcha Napoleon. Not one. What's oh. this? Um, Eclair. 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 Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, you want some of this or am I eating the whole thing? Of course. We're oh, here. we're gonna share. Okay, fine. Eclair is a fascinating, really nice hold. Soft on the inside, crispy on the outside. Walking in here, just immediately, the warmth and understanding of how a space should work, 100% it's gorgeous, gorgeous, right? The counters and the offerings are gorgeous. The types of breads, the different flours and techniques that they have to use just on the bread offerings alone tell you you're dealing with a master. You move on, they have a whole chocolate case, macaron case, oh, yeah. there's a dairy case, there's a whole sandwich grab and go section. They have some of the most beautiful, uh, classically baked, pastries from around the world, not just specifically French or something. Uh, 
Everything we've seen here and touched here has been another level. This is what he does, he goes hard, he goes very hard, and he expects, you know, nothing less. He needs to be recognized. Moses Wendell is uh, easily graduated. He's got all outdoor status within the fine kosher, within the kosher cooking world in the United States for sure. Easily. Oh, 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 oh,